y'all welcome back to my channel so in this video i'm basically gonna be telling people like well i'm gonna be helping people get information on like gaming computers or gaming laptops or whatever because a lot of people ask me and i guess because my sl runs so smooth and like i don't know how to explain it but y'all know like y'all didn't seeing other people on SL like their videos whatever you're just like mm, you can tell they lagging and stuff like and don't get me wrong I be lagging too sometimes it just depends like if I'm on a land by myself or if it's just a couple people like I don't be really lagging but obviously like if I go to an event hell yeah I be fucking lagging like what the fuck but other than that like my shit runs smooth but a lot of people have asked me like in the comments and they're like, oh, what kind of laptop are you using? Oh, what are your PC specs or whatever? I just want to get this straight. I do not play SL on a laptop. And there's nothing wrong with playing SL on a laptop. But I just feel like, mm, no, like, I feel like a gaming com computer PC is way better than a laptop. Like, a laptop, I feel like you can't really customize your parts. Like, a PC... You can upgrade your parts. Like, I recently posted on my story, like, a couple days ago. I bought me some more PC parts because, yeah, like, I really need them parts. But certain things I look for, well, if you are thinking about upgrading, getting another PC, or if you're like, oh, I'm going to stick to a gaming laptop, and you're wondering, like, what specs you need, I'm going to help y'all out. I'm going to give y'all, like, the, I don't want to say the bare minimum, but, like, you know, to get y'all a little idea of what y'all should look for or whatever. Because, y'all, I'm not no PC nerd, geek, whatever. So, yeah. So, basically, I just want to go ahead and start off. The specs that I have in my computer is I have a Resident 5 currently. Um, My graphics card is like a NVIDIA 1660-something. Um, and then I have 16 gigabytes of RAM. Those are like the main three things that really matter when it comes to a gaming computer, gaming PC, laptop, whatever. I feel like everything else don't really matter. Like, let me show y'all my computer. So this is the computer that I have currently, but as you can see, it's unavailable. And I responded to somebody's comment before when they were asking like, oh, what are you, what kind of computer do you have or whatever? As y'all can see the little PC parts, like, oh, it go to 3.1 gigahertz, quad core, GTX. I changed this. The graphics card, I changed that. Um, So I don't have that no more. Um, I don't have eight gigabytes no more. I changed it to 16 um 64 bit whatever and then it has resin i think before this computer had resin 3 like i didn't even know that existed so i was like mm -mm, no i can't so yeah i updated see i think see look it says amd resin 3 no so i had upgraded my shit to resin 5 and then i upgraded my ram to 16 and i upgraded my graphics card to a 1660 which is way better than this fucking 1050 like no but anyway um the parts that i bought y'all probably like damn what parts did you buy i upgraded well i haven't upgraded yet but i have the parts that i'm gonna upgrade soon when i go home like when i get out of school when i get out of college in like may like i should be going home like the first week of may type shit i bought resin 7 and that's, I, f I think people say that Resin 7 is way better than Resin 9. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I think I'll be seeing a lot of stuff. People be like, Resin 9 is not really all that. Like, I think Resin 7 is, is you know, it's up there. And then I got 32 gigabytes of RAM. So, yeah. And I didn't, I'm not upgrading my graphics card. Maybe in the future, like probably by the end of the year, maybe sometime next year, I'll upgrade my graphics card. And I feel like that'd be it. Like, I don't need 64 gigabytes of RAM. Like, no, because I don't play PC games. The only game I play on PC is V, not VU, <laughs> VU, is Second Life. And then I stream on, stream on my computer on Twitch and shit. But other than that, I don't need to update my graphics card, like, you know? But yeah, y'all can see. And y'all, I was lucky because when I bought this computer, it was before COVID was like getting bad. Cause y'all know PCs, well, if y'all don't know, PCs were so much cheaper before COVID started. And I'm not even playing. Like this computer, for all of this, 
this computer was like six hundred dollars six hundred some dollars and at the time y'all i did not pay for this computer up front i did payments i was doing like a hundred some dollars a month but yeah and then i was working at the time and shit too but yeah and then i remember i was looking at to see like if they still had this computer as y'all can see over a thousand people bought this computer because it's a thousand some ratings more people probably bought it but i don't know why but on the site they do not have this computer on there no more also um the price for this computer just kept going up as covid was getting worse like when we was on lockdown the computer was going up to 700 800 and then eventually i think it probably went up to a thousand i'm not sure and then it says unavailable even on the site it's not on there no more so yeah i'm just letting y'all know and for the people that's probably like "Ooh, but what if i get this there's nothing wrong with getting this but i'm gonna let y'all know now when you get computers like this like say if i really didn't have the money like this is cheap 40 40 dollars a month like yeah but um obviously you want to update this graphics card this graphics card is garbage garbage graphics card super garbage um upgrade your ram um upgrade this well it says intel i5 i mean i guess but you definitely need to upgrade this graphics card and upgrade your ram to 16 gigabytes but for the most part somebody could get this computer like and if you buy it just like this like oh i'm not gonna upgrade or anything don't expect high quality you know unless you play with your settings but more than likely you're not gonna be able to put your stuff on ultra you're gonna be lagging i'm just letting you know so yeah so on best buy i remember before i wanted to get a gaming laptop and eventually maybe sometime next year i still do want a gaming laptop because sometimes i might want to play sl in the bed i can't because i gotta sit at my desk to play sl and stuff like that um, the computer that I wanted, I wanted this. I think it was this because it was like seven hundred dollars. Well, technically it's eight, but seven hundred dollars. I wanted this computer so bad, but they did not have it in stock when I was going, and I was just like, oh my gosh. So, yeah, or no, 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 was it this? I think it was this, but they raised the price. Anyway, as y'all can see, since they got a sale, I would get this. I would get something like this. Took about 40 years to fucking upload. I mean, to um load. And then y'all could do 12 months on this too, but you paying $60. Um, we look at the specs. Um, 144 hertz gaming laptop. Intel Core 5. Okay, G4. Okay, like, you know, but I just still don't like the RAM. I need more than 8 gigabytes. But this is a good computer though, like it really is. This is this is a good laptop. Um yeah, and then the one that I was talking about, which is this Acer laptop, like I said, I think in store I wanted it. It was like seven hundred dollars, like seven hundred something, eight hundred, whatever. But it's way more now. Um, as y'all can see, look, i7, i core seven, which is your CPU. And then it has a better graphics card than what the fuck I got in my gaming computer. And then it got 16 gigabytes. So y'all can see the price. Like, this is a good computer to get. And it is nothing wrong with making payments. Like, $90 a month, it ain't nothing wrong with that. Um, and then on Amazon, I was looking at, what the f Y'all, this computer is $9,000. And it's only three stars no ma'am <laughs> no ma'am but yeah um i want to say y'all can find good computers like this 700 dollars i core 3 no ma'am i can't no i at least want to tell y'all to start off with a i core 5 or i5 do not get no i3 i promise you do not get an i3 do not do not and then most of these computers that are going to be under a thousand are going to have eight gigabytes of ram like most of these eight gigabytes ram eight gigabytes ram you know you can always upgrade by some ram ram don't be nothing like 16 gigabytes ram i think is like either 100 something or 200 so yeah and then y'all see resin 9 no people say resin 9 is garbage but yeah this computer i5 
resin 9 that's why it's two thousand dollars and then eight gigabyte like how you got resin 9 but you got eight gigabytes of ram no 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 no. a lot it got 32 gigabytes of ram okay never mind i was about to get on y'all but yeah i'm not telling y'all to go out here and spend three thousand folks because there's people out there like creators Y'all know them big creators on SL, they probably got $4,000, $5,000 gaming computers. And I don't blame them because you want high quality, you know, stuff when you out here creating. But I'm just letting y'all know what I have. This computer is so cute. Like, the case of it is so cute. But, yeah, iCore 5, 8 gigabytes RAM, and this graphics card. Uh, what is this? This graphics card is so boo-boo. Like, no. I just cannot um but for the most part yeah um what is this a touch screen oh in all-in-one computers i don't know most people i think that play second life don't have all-in-one computers like when i was going through my sims phase which i'm gonna be getting into that very soon probably in the summer because i ain't gonna have shit to do um most people that play sims have like all-in-one computers well i ain't gonna say most some people have gaming computers you know some people have gaming laptops whatever and then there's people out there who have all-in-one computers where it's basically a monitor like all your stuff is in the computer like you don't have to buy another monitor or whatever but yeah i don't really trust all-in-one computers but i mean mm, this one is iCore 5 32 gigabytes ram but like I said, no, I don't, I, I, I personally wouldn't buy this, but you know, if you probably like, oh, I gotta buy a monitor, I gotta buy a keyboard, I gotta buy a mouse, I gotta, no, nah, never mind, I still wouldn't buy the shit either. Even if it's touch screen, I do not care. A monitor is like a hundred dollars and mouse, keyboard, that ain't nothing but like what, maybe $60 together and no. Anyway, y'all, hopefully I'm gonna put like the specs for people that are like, oh, I forgot what you said, like what kind of specs I need, like starter like whatever i'm gonna put those in the description so y'all can like look amongst yourselves or whatever because no and it is nothing wrong with getting a pre-built computer just letting y'all know people be out there trying to oh you have a pre-built computer oh this is like ain't nothing wrong with that like okay i don't feel like putting my shit together myself like what but yeah and a tip if you have if you like say you get one of um the, the computer that i showed that was like four hundred dollars but the specs were so garbage let's just say you get that computer you can take your parts i think you have to have a membership at best buy i'm not sure but you can take your stuff to best buy and they can put the parts in there for you for free so i'm just letting y'all know because that's what i do if y'all probably like oh who be putting your parts in your thing in your computer best buy because i think i have geek squad total tech i have some so yeah i'm just letting y'all know so don't mess don't be if you don't know what you're doing don't be trying to put the parts in yourself because you might fuck up and you done spent 200 300 on a cpu or on a graphics card and you done messed it up like yeah but yeah that's basically it i just wanted to help y'all out for people that are like oh what are your pc specs what computer specs do you have and also i think i'm gonna start putting that in my description too because people be asking me that a lot they be wanting to know like what are my specs or whatever but yeah because like i don't really lag as much like like i'm here by myself obviously but i don't really lag that much and this is Black Dragon, by the way, if y'all don't know. This is Black Dragon. So, also, you want to take high-quality pictures and stuff. You know, I have a video on how to take high-quality pictures on Firestorm. But most people take high-quality pictures on Black Dragon. Mm, you might want to get a, you know, a decent computer. Like I said, the decent specs that I'm going to have in the description. Because y'all not going to be able to run Black Dragon functionally. I don't know if that's a word, but it's a word today. Like, y'all are going to be lagging so badly. Like, really. And I think my settings are on Ultra. Like, I think, like, my avatar settings are on Ultra on Black Dragon. So, yeah. Because I don't care about nothing else. But, yeah. Make sure y'all like and subscribe. I hope this video helped people that have been asking that question. And, yeah. Make sure y'all shop me Fallout for tattoos and stuff. And I'll be back with another video.